for the a hundredth time, that's not a thing. Playoff Jimmy is not a thing. Emo Jimmy, thing. Football Jimmy, thing. Tennis Jimmy, thing. Daddy Jimmy, thing. Zaddy Jimmy, thing. Playoff Jimmy, not so much. What's up? This is Jimmy Butler, Jimmy Buckets, Emo Jimmy. This is my slam cover. Certain people in the world love Emo Jimmy, as do I. I would definitely hoop with my hair like that, but I can't, I think it's just, it's this eye. I can't see nothing with my eye. Then I only got like, not 20, 20, just 20. And um, that's hard. But uh, I love that part of me. Um, I love all types of music, as everybody knows. Um, Pete is incredible. He was just at our game against uh, the Mavs. You know, he reached out and was like, yo, we have to do this. Like, he loves basketball, he loves tennis as well. And I was like, you know I'm down. Anything to shake up anything on the internet and continually be myself, be happy, and love my life and what I'm doing, I'm down. And they made that happen and it turned out incredible. And the turnaround was so fast. People think that I'd done it, you know, a long time ago, I did it all-star break. Like, exactly, and it came out seven days later, if that. I do a lot of stuff, I do, I do a lot of stuff. And I try to showcase that on my socials or you know, when I'm around fans as often as I can, just to show them that I'm just like everybody else. Like, don't be fooled, don't get confused because you see me on TV or a commercial or, I don't know, a billboard or something. Uh, I do a lot of the same stuff y'all do, I'm probably just, better at it than all y'all, but you know, I can't help that. I've built so many bonds, friendships, brotherhoods, through all of these other sports and things that I really like to do. So I enjoy going to support my friends just like they love to come and support me. I love to learn about their culture. I love to go visit where they're from. And if I don't like practice and be able to talk trash to them, knowing that they don't know, that I don't know, that they don't know, that I don't know, that I really can't win. I just keep them guessing. Five, two. I think I, I want to do music. I can tell you this country album right now has about 62 songs, I think. We're still looking for some women to hop on these tracks with me. I, I definitely need that. But it's, uh, it's in the mix and it's, it's a banger. I really want to be the, the DJ Khaled. I love DJ Khaled. I think he's a genius. He uh, stays right down the road from me so I get to see his house all the time even though that has nothing to do with what you just asked. Um, I just think that he's, he's, just, he's just brilliant. He's a, a tremendous person at strategizing and letting people know what he has coming and he's I don't know, a collaboration mastermind. Like he can get anybody on any song and make it make sense. I gotta be able to, to make that happen. I'm not comparing myself to DJ Khaled. I don't think I have that, but he drinks cappuccinos and I drink cappuccinos. So I, I feel like it has to be a thing. When you see Big Face, you just see, I don't mean to speak to my, about myself in third person. You just see Jimmy Butler, cause you know that it's my brand. But just like the basketball player, performance coach, there's a strength and conditioning, James Scott. There's like all of these other people that are helping me as a brand in basketball be the best that there is. It's the same with Big Face. Even though my name's on it, I have an incredible team that's helping me run it because I don't know if you know this or not, but basketball is the one thing that I really have to be focused on a lot. And they do an incredible job. And I'm very grateful for the group and the team that I do have because I know it's difficult and I, Guarantee it's even more difficult working with me, um, but they, they handle it pretty well. I know where I wanna be five, 10 years from now, but you can't even, you can't get five to 10 years from now if you're not worried about the right now and, to, and the today. Um, I really need this shop in Miami just because I want people to realize like this isn't a game for me. When I'm not practicing, when I'm not with my kids, when I'm not in a game, I can tell you where I'm gonna be. It's gonna be in this coffee shop, you know, meeting all the fans of myself, of coffee, um, because I do love coffee and I do wanna bring 
the best coffee to Miami because I don't think there's a spot like that here yet. And I want the first Big Face Cafe to be that. So that's where I'm going to be. And um, we need that. Miami needs that along with the championship. But we definitely need Big Face Coffee. You're sideways, you're looking this way, and you're kind of coming up like this. Okay. Yep, yep. I just don't like shooting threes because I don't think nothing's wrong with you. I want to run and I want to hit somebody. You can't hit nobody if you shoot threes. I want to see who's going to quit first. I'm going to keep running in there. I'm going to hit you. I'm going to hit you again. I'm going to hit you again. And we're going to see who's going to quit. I think we got enough guys in the league. We got enough guys on my team that can shoot and shoot at a high level. But if I'm not attacking the paint, if I'm not putting pressure on the rim, um, who else is going to do it? That's the way that I look at it. So as I know I can shoot and make threes at a high clip, I do not want to do that. I want to run in there and I want to run people over. There's like three things that you got to have in order to win a championship. You got to be playing your best basketball at the right time. You got to be healthy and you got to be lucky. That's just the way that it is. So can't nobody tell right now today who's going to have all three of those things. So knock on wood, where the wood at? Knock, knock, knock. You don't know what player is going to be healthy. And I want everybody to be healthy. But is Denver the same team if Jokic not healthy? Is Boston the same team if Jalen or Jason not healthy? Are we the same team if I'm not healthy, Bam not? You can go down the line. So there's a, there's a lot of things that got to fall in the right place for individuals to win the championship. We just got a different way of going about things. We're overly confident in a good way. Our coaching staff cares, and they're constantly studying on how we could make everybody on our roster stick to their strong suits. The ownership cares. They're always there in every practice. They're on the planes. Um, we're talking to one another. We really fuck with one another, which is a good thing. And um, I'm on the team, so I'm taking my chances every time. It's a time where people really got to think about going up against the Miami Heat and myself. Like, I know what I'm capable of. I know what my squad is capable of. And don't nobody want to see us in a seven game series anyways. We know that. Boy, oh boy, if I could song right or I could Neymar a soccer ball, you probably wouldn't be talking to me right now. I'd probably be too big time for you, not gonna lie. Mm -hmm.